एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल दिस इज द यूट्यूब You are welcomed in my new video. In today's video, I have come up with a new update on K-pop in K-pop world, and that is K-pop school in Norway. How I found out about this K-pop school and ended up there is quite a long story which I won't bother with here. In this video, I will tell you little brief about Norway and the second thing K-pop school in Norway. and how did kpop ended up in norway in this video you will get to know about interesting facts about norway which will make you go to a trip to norway every detail will be related to this in video about norway so keep watching this video till the end so before starting this new video those who are new to my channel subscribe to my channel and tap the bell icon so that you can get the notifications of my new videos and also help me to complete 5000 subscribers soon for person ko pass karne mein kuch tips and advices ki zarurat hai to join membership mai apne youtube channel jaidu par aapko kpop audition ke advices और टिप्स और के पोर्शन की ट्यूटोरियल देती हूँ आई होप आप मेंबरशिप को ज्वाइन करें ये मेंबरशिप ज्वाइन करके आपको काफी इंस्टेंट एक्सेसेस मिलेंगे जो आपको हेल्प करेंगे आपको के ऑडिशन को पास करने में ताकि आपका के आइडल बनने का सपना पूरा हो सके मल्टीपल बेनिफिट्स हैं, जैसे कि लॉयल्टी बेजेस इमोजीज एंड पर्स मेंबर ओनली चैट रूम्स यहाँ पर सिर्फ जो मेंबर्स होंगे जिनके पास मेंबरशिप होगी उनके लिए एक अलग से चैट रूम बनाया जाएगा जहाँ पे सभी आप लोग बात कर सकते हैं और अपनी वरीज को सॉल्व कर सकते हैं कंसल्ट करके मेंबर ओनली लाइव चैट्स जितने भी मेंबर्स होंगे जिनके पास मेंबरशिप होगी उनके लिए एक लाइव चैट में ऑर्गेनाइज करूंगी कुछ टाइम में ताकि वो लोग अपने से बात कर सके सभी आप कैपर फ्रेंड्स हो सके और अपनी जो बातें हैं अपने एक दूसरे से शेयर कर सकें पर्सनल चैट्स इसमें आप मुझसे पर्सनली बात कर सकते हैं अपनी वरीज और अपने जो भी आपको टिप्स चाहिए कुछ भी ऑडिशन से रिलेटेड ऑडिशन वीडियो से रिलेटेड सब कुछ मैं आपको बताऊंगी इसके साथ साथ वीकली और मंथली इवेल्यूशन सेशन आपके ऑडिशन वीडियो और आपके ऑडिशन के डांस सिंगिंग और फोटोज उनके आप मुझे सेंड कर सकते हैं ताकि मैं आपको इवेल्यूशन कर सकूं बता सकूं कि वो जो आपने फोटोज और वीडियोस बनाई हैं वो आपके जो ऑडिशन में अप्लाई करने के लायक है या नहीं है अर्ली एक्सेस टू वीडियोस जो मैं वीडियोस डालती हूँ उस पर आपको अर्ली एक्सेस मिल सके ताकि आप जल्द से जल्द अप्लाई कर सके क्योंकि आप भी जानते हैं आजकल जो ऑडिशन होते हैं उनके जो है जो ड्यूरेशन होता है वो होता है फोर्टी आवर्स का आपको जल्द जल्द अप्लाई करना होता है क्योंकि आजकल सीट्स बहुत जल्दी फुल हो जाती है इसलिए आपको जल्दी जल्द पता चल सके कि किसका ऑडिशन हो रहा है कब हो रहा है तो आपको मिल सकती है एक्सेस इस पर भी और साथ ही प्रायोरिटी टू कमेंट्स क्योंकि जो ये भी क्वेम ऑडिशन होते हैं वो ग्लोबल लेवल पे होते हैं तो सभी लोग इसके लिए अप्लाई करते हैं इसलिए जो मेरे पास कमेंट्स आते हैं वो भी बहुत ज्यादा नंबर पे आते हैं इसलिए मैं सिर्फ कुछ को ही रिप्लाई कर पाती हूँ कुछ को नहीं रिप्लाई कर पाती हूँ इसलिए अगर आपके मेंबरशिप होगी तो आपके जो कमेंट्स हैं उनको मैं प्रायोरिटी दूंगी और उन्हें सबसे पहले रिप्लाई करने की कोशिश करूंगी आप लोगों की मेंबरशिप को ज्वाइन करने से जो सपोर्ट मुझे मिलेगा न कि सिर्फ आप बेनिफिट को रिसीव करेंगे बट आप मेरी भी मदद करेंगे ताकि ऐसे ही मैं यूट्यूब पर वीडियो को क्रिएट करती रहूँ और आपके पर्सन का पास करने में और आपका कैप आइडल बनने का सपना पूरा होने में एक जरिया बन सकू सो ज्वाइन द मेंबरशिप नाउ लेट मी ब्रीफ यू ऑन नॉर्वे बेसिकली नॉर्वे इज अंडेवियन country encompassing mountains glaciers and deep coastal fjords and oslo the capital is a city of green spaces and museums and preserved 9th century viking ships are displayed at oslo's viking ship museum bergen with the colorful wooden houses is the starting point for the cruises to the dramatic sogne ford and norway is also known for fishing hiking and skiing notably at lillehammer's olympic resort and the currency of norway is norwegian kron now let's talk about kpop school in norway basically about 2 hours ago i discovered something amazing and this news is going to have a special college for kpop fans in the kpop world so what is this special college thing in norway it is called folkehøy skole it is basically a folk high school and are often called the world's freest school so What is this Folkehog School? Introducing the Folkehog School, yet another unique gem found more or less only in Norway. And how I found out about this Folkehog School and ended up there is quite a long story which I won't bother with here. It is bit hard to explain. The easiest way is that it is a sort of a organized gap year or a kindergarten for adults as I have heard it it described as here in Norway. and it gives student an opportunity to dedicate a year to something they are passionate about or to discover new passion it can also work as a sort of a technical school and it all just depends on which subject of study that you choose and this is schools do not have any normal subjects they have a lot of different folkhøy schooler in norway and headland folkhøy high school is the first school to offer this kind of study students will learn about everything so basically you live at the school for a year and do the things you love with people who has the same interest as you and this is school is mostly for fun but there are some advantages now let's talk about what is the kpop school about the folk high school has different paths which you can choose and they now announced a new path called kpop arts here you can learn about korean culture dance music drama and language you will get to learn like first korean culture 
In some of the classes, you will learn about the Korean culture. They will focus mostly on the modern culture, but you will also learn about the traditional one. Second thing you will learn is Korean dance. There will be a lot of dancing. If you don't like to move your body, this is not a school for you. You will learn a lot of K-pop dances from both girl and boy groups. You will also improve different dancing techniques via K-pop fitness. The third thing you will learn here is Korean music. You will all listen to a K-pop songs a lot in the class. And this is to improve your pronunciation and of course because we love it. If you want, you can take singing classes to improve your Korean pronunciation and flow while singing. The fourth thing you will learn here is Korean drama. As well as music, you will watch a lot of Korean dramas in classes. This is to improve your pronunciation as well as learning more about the culture. The fifth thing you will learn here is Korean language. Yes, you will learn a lot of Korean. They start with teaching the alphabet and go on to holding a conversation in Korean. You won't be fluent in Korean since it is only for a year. But you will learn the most important words and phrases. Doesn't this sound like a dream? Can it be any better? As hard as it sounds, it actually gets better. The school isn't that expensive as I have seen others are. And there will also be a trip to Korea in the budget. You live at a dorm alone or with a roommate and get food for the whole day. This is worth the money guys, I bet. And just think about living a year with the amazing people and doing the thing you love every day. My best friend and I seriously consider this. So, what do you think? Do you have a school like this in your country? And does this make you want to move to Norway? Actually, in the last couple of years, there has been a rising popularity of Korean music, also known as K-pop, in the Western world. K-pop has become more and more popular in Europe as groups and artists perform in various European cities when they go on a tour. And K-pop has slowly made its way into Norway as well. Stores like Neo Tokyo and Outland in Oslo have sold albums, live sticks and merch from solo artists, boy groups and girl groups for a longer time. And in recent times, more shops have also started to sell these products and many clothing stores have begun to play K-pop songs. Many K-pop groups come to Europe when they are on tour but Norway has yet to be included in them. But even though this country is often excluded, a couple of groups have come to Oslo for a concert and or a dance workshops. Omona is an annual event dedicated to Korean pop culture and it's a place where teenagers from all over the country with an interest in Korea and the culture can meet. It's organized by k an organization for a Korean pop culture in Norway and is held in Oslo every summer and lasts for either one or two days. Just by reading it, I feel like it will be so much fun. So how it will be to enjoy this event in Norway by yourself. Voyage to K-pop was a free concert held on June 11th last year to celebrate the 60th anniversary of diplomatic relations between Norway and the Republic of Korea. It was organized by the Embassy of Republic of Korea in Norway. Two K-pop groups, one was Monster X and the other was Momoland and the two Korean artists Jian Ping and Jang Jin performed at the concert in Norway. So when are you guys planning to go to Norway to join Folk High School's Folk Hawk School to live your dream and become K-pop idol? And that's it for today's video. I hope I answered all your questions well regarding to this video about informations on Norway. I make more updates related to BTS, K-pop, k portion tutorials, k portion tapes, life of K-pop training and idol and current type videos like these. You can check out my playlist. I will leave the link in the description box. Those who have curious related to video, ask me in my comment box. If you liked what you see, then make sure to click the subscription button. It will help me to grow. Also encourage me to make more updates related to BTS, K-pop, k portion tutorials, k portion tapes, life of K-pop training and idol and current type videos like these. You can check out my playlist. I will leave the link in the description box box and help me to complete 5000 subscribers soon love you all stay safe see you guys in my next video thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel jay Dio. bye bye